Alright guys, how y'all doing? I'm a Dark Side Gamer, we're on Dark Souls again, this is another live stream that I'm going to do and I'm going to talk about what actually happened after beating that spider boss. Uh, I did record a few parts but I've ended up deleting it because um, as soon as you beat that boss, you hit another boss and I'm way, way under leveled to even fight the damn thing. Uh, so what I'm going to do guys on this part... The reason I've gone live is because I want to show you what um, what I'm actually talking about regarding um, the the next boss and stuff like that, and um, not even not even that, just like the whole uh, the whole situation of what we're of what we're up to now. Uh, so we've got that uh, we've got that castle behind us, which is like it's open now. Um, but there's like loads of snakes inside it, and there's like that's pretty much the only enemy that's in there. But they're really difficult to kill, and the 500 souls are kill as well, so they're actually pretty cool. But we're back here again. Seems to be coming back to this area a lot. You know, I think to get down to uh, to get to Blight Town, I'm gonna go a different way. Instead of going the long way, I'm just gonna go around. I'm gonna go down, down and round. You may have noticed I've got no souls here. I've got like 288 because I died inside that. Um, I died inside that Sen Palace, so just keep dying in there. One thing I've not done yet, I've not put all my stuff away.
Oh, I missed him. Shit. Actually, I'm... It's good that I've come down here because... I want to see if I can get some more material for um, another upgrade. I'm hoping so. <laughs> Happens every time. I didn't even see that guy though. Kill them all and I get nothing. Great. Guarantee the humanity every single time, though. As if he moved though. What does this uh imminent bean pole? Uh 
Okay, beam pole. Fuck. Technically, inside the sewers you don't have to go all, after all the frogs, you can just avoid them all. That's what I tend to do. behind me but it's alright. See they've gone down to um they've gone down to two hundred a kill now. They used they were four hundred when I first ever came here. Anyway, there's no guarantee that I won't do I won't die around here anyway. Green one. I didn't need that. Never mind. It's this bit down. It's this bit here right now that is kind of the, the hard part. So the reason I'm going back to Blight Town, guys, is I'm just showing you what uh, what I came across uh, after I beat the boss. I haven't actually shown it on a recording or anything. Um, if you've played the game before, you'll know what it is. If you haven't, then keep watching. Why is he there? Great, this is fucked this up. I can't fight two of them on a fucking short platform like that. This other guy needs to back off. Wow, now they're both there, and I can't even... There's literally nothing I can do. How did he hit me? He's gonna do it again, the motherfucker. Survived. It was either that or fucking climb back up the ladder and get out the whole section. I weren't doing that. Look, 
Okay. No move, move. Ho 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 ho! Canal, even with an upgraded axe, it still takes three hits with that. It's another one. Nah, they're too easy to kill. They're too easy to kill them anyway. It's a good place to farm round here. Uh, two, uh, fucking hell, six, seven, six, five. That's not too bad, actually. From area to area, anyway. Too slow. Another one here. Oh! There's two, they're going, they're branching out, either way. Okay, no. Ah, oh, I'm gonna get it, never mind. Oh, fuck off. Bob fight's coming up soon, anyway. I'm surprised I'm getting them. It's only 200, but it'll do. It's giving me more than the actual kill of the uh, the uh, creature itself. Did that on purpose. Next level up's not till 22,000, which is way off. Let's keep going. My parrying has been off recently. 
I need to get better at doing it, really. Wait, is he a way of getting down to that other section from here? I hate this bit. See what I mean? What the fuck? Oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Just don't give me enough. Okay. Huh. Fucking thing won't get off me. I know them flying things are here somewhere. Oh, I missed. Okay. Wow, I didn't expect to get a kill like that. Nice. Oh, the more of them are coming now. See them over there, two more. Easily dealt with with this. Whilst we're here as well, guys, I'm gonna look, gonna try and look for more uh, materials for the axe, for the great axe. I want to upgrade it again before I go inside that other place, the Sen Fortress. It's like these, it's like these uh, mosquito things, like, they like slightly respawn. You just gotta wait for them to come. There you go. And then that's it then, you don't get another, you don't, you just don't get another one. Uh, 
Might get poisoned. Might get poisoned. No. may seem crazy but this area is becoming my favourite area now because we noticed how I went from 6,000 souls going into Blight Town and now I've got 10,000. You get so much here. It's absolutely, it's like the te it's like just teaming with wildlife. Crazy fucking wildlife. See, you kill him and then another one comes up. Oh. Kill a bastard. Alright, so we're on 11,000 with that. Let's put that around. More fucking repairs. Right, just gonna see if I can get one of them, uh, one of them upgrades, guys, like a, uh, an item. Probably not, but it's worth a try. One over there, see these little leeches. They give you, uh, they can give you uh, what I'm looking for. Bastard. I actually thought I was going to get uh, get poisoned there because just the way I was getting hit multiple times. Little bastard. Try and not use my, my miracle here, I can't be asked. There we go. Right. Nothing. Even though I'm wearing a ring that like supposed to give you items more 
really not working. Because I'm not getting I'm not getting those items right now, so I don't know. Sucks. That's it, I didn't even get one. Fucking hell. Just goes to show that it, it not always doesn't always give you what you want on this game. So again, we still cannot upgrade the uh, the axe, unfortunately. All right, so uh, I've got nine esters. Oh, I've got plenty. I've got plenty for the uh, for what I've got planned now. But I'm not going to go into the boss battle, guys. Not with 12,000 souls. Because I actually really, really want to level up again. So I'm not, um, I'm not determined to go into the boss battle with, uh, with that. In fact, the boss battle, guys, is just, uh, wait, there is something there. You see it there, look. Yeah. Yeah, I got it. I got it. Fuck it, I'm not asked about that. At the end of the day, I have got, I'll now have two of those, and that is a big difference because if I can get a third one, it's going to be good. Be good that, but get a third one. We need a third one. Everything's going to plan at the moment with this. Apart from not dying, which I've not died, I haven't died yet. Well, on this part. Alright, guys, so here we go. Now, we beat, we beat uh, the Q-Lag boss got past that and I haven't spoken about this section down here uh, yet so let's just run straight through this is the boss arena that we fought the uh, the Kulag in or the giant fire spider whatever it was it was also a female so it was kind of it's kind of weird kind of weird bosses in this game but it's all mythical stuff it's it's awesome I like this. Uh, I like this game. It's really good, really, really good, and difficult. I just keep coming back to it all the time. Though I'm so addicted to this at the moment, it's unbelievable. All right, so we uh, we rang the bell. I put that in the part, uh, and then we went all the way down, and there was this weird, like, woman. By the way, that's deafening in my ear, that looks like. But there's a fire there's a there's a bonfire here and you've got this you've got this girl who, who you can offer humanities to. And you've got to find the firekeeper's soul, but I'm not quite sure how you how you get that. Whether you can kill it, I'm not sure, but I don't know. 
But I don't think it would be a good idea to kill it anyway. Anyway, right. So we're resting at that bonfire. But this next section, guys, I like I said, I'm not doing it. I'm not doing this. So uh, what I'm going to do, I'm going to, I'm just going to show you what I'm actually up against. You might be able to see the boss in the distance. He's basically like lurking. It's pretty, it's pretty cool actually how you can you can actually see him from a distance if you if you stand at a certain point. So yeah, it's in demon ruins, guys. This is the place I was in before. And there he is. If you could, if you like, just over that that rock. It's basically that thing that you can see moving around. That's the boss over there, guys. Um, there's the fog gate. You walk through the fog gate. You go up there, and. I'm not even kidding, you, you, uh, it kills you, it just kills you outright, it's, it's insane, I'm not even going to bother, um, do these attack you, oh, see that, of course, Crazy that the littlest of enemies can cause so much trouble. So we've got all we've got this here, and it, once we beat the boss, guys, I'm sure that we could be able to, like, do like completely go through there and go into the next section. But until uh, until we do, there's nothing. You know, we just can't beat it. Can't beat the. Uh, Unless it's a special way of killing this thing. But I haven't found any special way or anything like that, so... Alright, so I think this is a dead end, guys. Uh, I've just... I never, I haven't literally haven't walked to the end of it, but it just like... All that section there... Is the... It's like the boss arena. But we're not going there. Wow, the ceiling's fucking crazy. Or is that the ceiling or is that the wall? I don't know. This whole area looks like f fucking hell itself. Alright, so that is basically that. Um, the boss is not... Uh, and whether or not the boss is optional, I'm, I'm not too sure. I think it's optional because um, because of the area that I keep going into off camera. So, these won't attack you unless you attack them, so. I'm just gonna check something a minute. Um, oh, okay. Ah, oh, poison resistant 36 zero, uh, 36. That's not too bad.
Uh, poison resist is pretty good. Pretty good on um, on this, even though it's lower. Can I upgrade it? Wow. Uh. Okay, let's just um. Poison resistance on that. Ninety four Z ninety four. Let's put that on. And let's put that on. Oh, so it's kinda of like what I had on before, but it's black this time. But apparently the poison resistance is well is a lot um, is a lot better. Um, I'm not going to get rid of the uh, I'm not going to get rid of the other the other stuff because obviously that's you need that. But uh, poison resistance, yeah, the poison resistance on this is awesome. That's really good. Got some new armor there as well. But still the same helm though, which I actually do need to upgrade all this, all the armor and stuff like that, make it a little bit stronger. I'm not gonna lie, guys, that fucking belt is annoying. Uh, I'm gonna go to the, I'm gonna go to the, uh, the bonfire again, guys, simply because it's like. It's a trek to the next one, so... guy started to look more like the uh, my character from Bloodborne. It was like I, I had a, like a black cloak on in Bloodborne as well. I look more like the fucking Grim Reaper. Let's run through here. <laughs> see some combat over there that means that like he was like fighting the boss and if you watch close oh it disappears sometimes it uh it shows the death if you touch the uh the little blood the little blood puddles on the floor it shows like a repeat of what happens to them it's pretty cool when the it's pretty cool when the game's online I'm not sure what that's talking about because there's no chest there, so. A lot of people online today. All right, let's just hope that we can get through this now without, well, we haven't died yet, so. Uh. Oh, fucking hell. Ah, right. Nice. I can tell the poison build-up's not as bad. Great. I like that. I do like that. I'm going to be upgrading this, guys. Oh, 
come on. Yeah, more damage. Right, I've got to be careful here because I've died twice doing this. I literally thought about it in my head that I was going to fall off and I fell off. That is... Honest to God, this fucking game sometimes... I can't believe I did it again. That's like the third time that I've done that now. It's like, as soon as it gets to the top, it just... I don't know, I don't know why that keeps happening. Oh my god. So annoying. Seems that every time I get over 10,000 souls as well, so far, I always die. Oh man. Well, that's death number one on this stream anyway. Fucking, hopefully there won't be a second one. God. Makes me want, makes me wish that I'd used the bonfire at the bottom now as well. Because I wouldn't have had to walk all the way back so unpredictable this game sometimes you think you're gonna live and you think you're gonna be okay and then you're just not because you just get killed unexpectedly I don't know whether to um, whether to go and press the bonfire right now because I don't want to risk it. I don't want to like die and walk through all that shit again. Should make it. Oh yeah, nice. There we go. <sighs> Bet the souls are on the floor because I died on the floor. No? Oh, they'll probably be they'll probably be at the top or something like that. There we are. Try that again. Fuck's sake, honestly. And yes. <laughs>
I always get lost here. Uh, there it is. I always lose that ladder. I always get lost. Never find my way. Uh, can never find my way across properly. That's the longest ladder I've ever. Oh. Trust me guys, this goes on for ages, so... Right, here we go. We're alright now, we're out of it. Oh, man. Oh, I don't understand why. pie that I never use. I always just pick them up anyway. Never use them. I don't see the point. That's fine, you do that. Motherfucker. As if, as if I had to use uh, two Estus there. Never mind, they're all dead anyway. Make our way across that, go back down here. Uh, this, this bit's like not never here or there, it's just these little guys and they don't do nothing. But it's worth the points, so let's kill them. You only get 24 for each kill. That guy. It was like he tried to attack him back or something for a little bit then. Hey, showtime, how you doing, buddy? Yeah, I'm good. Uh, just what? Just waking up. About to have coffee, yeah. Uh, coffee definitely is the first thing of the day for a lot of people. 
Uh, I don't think so. Um, okay, so... I know, right? <laughs> yeah. So it made uh, made more progress since you last saw uh, saw this show. Um, beat the boss. The spider boss is dead. Killed her. Uh, and then got absolutely pummeled by another boss, like, right after it. Um, I'm kind of thinking that I'm under level to fight that damn thing. Uh, I was actually saying on uh, this broadcast that I was, you know. Yeah, yeah. I knew I'd kill it. I knew I'd get it. Just a matter of time. But it's uh, it's this it's this now that I'm struggling with at the moment. Uh, in fact, um, I want to. I actually want to level up before I go back in there. I don't want to. No, I don't want to. Go into that area with the uh, with the level that I'm on. I want to get another level. So let's let's kill some enemies round this uh, round this area. Pick it all up. Bad timing. Come on. Oh, whatever. Die at one shot anyway. Has everything been going with you? Yeah, fine. Fine. My uh, my morning shifts. So uh, I'm getting used to them now. Getting used to waking up at like half three in the morning <laughs> to go to work. You're like you know, uh, I actually I actually got up at half two this morning because uh, I'd slept for nine hours. I went to I felt felt sleepy like at night. Well, not at night time, but around tea time, and it was like half five. And I just went. I just ended up going for a lie down. Next, next thing I knew, it was nine hours later, and it was half two in the morning. I thought, oh, okay, so fair enough. So I woke up, had coffee and stuff like that, chilled out for a few hours. I went to work. I went to work in the morning. It, it feels like the days uh, huge, like you know. Oh yeah, yeah, I did yeah. Just feels like my, uh, just feels like my day's really big now. Got so much stuff to do. that most of the time I get good sleep I feel great yeah I felt I felt all right after I, I, I had a really bad headache the other day but I only slept for about three or four hours and then I sleep for nine hours and I felt absolutely fine so it must have done it must have done something I had a banging headache the other morning I'm surprised I even went in Oh, 
All right, guys, we're farming. We need 22,000. We need 22,000 souls, so we're going to do some farming. Because, uh, yeah, I just need to... I just need one more level up before I go inside that uh, fortress again. I don't like carrying loads of souls around, especially when they're in that area. Because I've died so many times, it's like, yeah. We farming. Yep. Oh, the grind is real on, on these games, isn't it? It's like, oh my god. It's just the grind of it is just ridiculous. It's just keep grinding. Oh, before I, um, I, actually, let's do that first. Need anything for? Uh, if I can, yeah. Oh, I can as well. Lovely. Nice, yeah, that's about exactly what I wanted. Exactly. I'm saving that. Uh, one, two, one. Not armor. Oh, nothing that I nothing that I don't have equipped is actually. No. Don't matter with that. Go with the weapons, because there's quite quite a few we can go for. So. I'm gonna drop some. I'm gonna drop a few things as well. I think. Well, not drop it, but I'm just gonna put it in my uh, my box. It's got in there though. Yeah. Farming. Well, um, but guys, the uh, the axe is the axe is even stronger now. Oh, I'm happy with I'm happy with the fact that I've managed to upgrade that again. Uh, I've up, I've actually upgraded it twice in in like the two times that I've actually been on it. So I'm really ha really like happy that I was able to uh, do it again um, it's a solid weapon yeah it is yeah I've got the other one as well I've got the um, I've got that as well the uh, the raw gargoyle tail axe it's not bad um, I'm trying to upgrade that as well a little bit but at the moment it's not I'm not having much luck getting that up but <sighs> Uh, as you can see, I've got like loads of swords. Somebody actually gave me that, uh, the dark sword. Somebody came into my game and actually just dropped it and gave it me. So I was like, okay, thank you. And then they killed me because obviously to get out, you know, to get rid of them, they have to kill you or you have to kill them. So 
Yeah, they killed me with uh, they killed me with pyromancy. So, and then I picked up my I I, I re picked up my souls that they dropped for me. They dropped uh, thirty thousand souls to me on the ground, and I leveled up like twice with it. So like, okay, thank you. It's so random, but I suppose that's the Dark Souls community. It was a uh, it was nice of them to do that. <laughs> Oh, cheeky. I'm not waiting around. Give me that. Yes. That shit didn't happen to me when I first died playing. <laughs> I think they, I think whoever it was, they were very high leveled. I think they were really high leveled. I guess that's how the community has evolved over the years, yeah. Well, these are new servers now, aren't they? Because with it being the remastered game, they're going to be new servers now, because uh, all this. So I think a lot of people are playing it now. Uh, I'm not quite... How old is this game? It's about three years old now. Remastered version. Uh, it's a little bit older, isn't it? Well, well not as old. Not as old as the uh, not as old as the first the original game. No, no pillage. Uh, we must have something like the uh, the original game was two thousand eleven. Yeah. Oh yeah, Demon Souls. Yeah, that's um, that's the first game I plan to get for PS5. Actually, uh, Demon Souls Remastered. I want that. I want that game. Oh my god! If it's anything like this, then hell yeah. Because I've never played. Uh, I've never played Demon Souls. So I kind of want to make it. I kind of want to play it because I've played this. I've played Bloodborne. I want to play Demon Souls now. I have played Noir. I didn't like. I didn't really like Noir that much. I thought that it was a little bit too, too, too rough, too, just absolutely ridiculous. Absolutely ridiculous, Noir. Um, like the first boss. I think it was either like the first boss or the second boss. The second boss just annihilated me, and I couldn't even beat it. I'm like, hmm, nah, I'm not feeling it. I didn't feel it. At least with this I'm progressing. And I'm getting used to the game now. Okay. Oh, uh, Showtime, have you, um, have you seen any footage of the, uh, the demo for Resident Evil 8 on PS5? Uh, Cyber Houdini actually, uh, downloaded it about a week or so ago. I watched it. Wow. It's, it's great. It looks great. It does look good. Um... It's a shame, really, that the demo's only on PS5 and not on PS4. Uh, he said that was unfair. He actually said that was unfair. I, I agree. Should have been on PS4 as well. I wanted to try it. Yeah. Yeah, where well you start off inside the uh, you start off inside the jail cell, like, and you start off in a dungeon, and then it sounds like there's a creature behind the wall or something. That's part of the reason I'm nervous about the PS4 version being good. Yeah, I know. Yeah, I know what you mean. Um, I am going to be getting the PS4 version, but I suppose. 
what I've been told is if you've got the PS4 version, you don't when, when you get a PS5, you don't have to buy the PS5 version because what you do is you have it on your library already and it converts over to your PS5 and the graphics are upgraded. So that's the that's the thing about it. It's you don't have to rebuy the game or something. It's just a weird it's weird how it how it works. Yeah. They seem to be pushing the PS5 version and the 4 version is just a side for yeah. It is now. Unfortunately. Hang on a sec, I'm just just getting a smoke out. Uh but, but yeah, I mean, I'm going to order the PS4 version because obviously I'm not, I've still not got the, the money to get PS5 yet, so uh, it could be a while before I do. But I want to play Resident Evil 8, so I, uh, being a Resident Evil fan that I am, I will get the uh, I will get the PS4 version and try it out. And I don't think there'll be any big, you know, like major glitches or problems. Kind of like Cyberpunk. I just remember when PS4 came out, they had the same large games on PS3. And they were awful compared to PS4. Yeah. I'll watch others play it before buying it. Yeah. I'm hoping to, uh, I'm hoping to play it on launch, on, uh, on launch night, uh, over here. Well, when it comes out in the UK, first time, first night. Uh, I don't know whether to stream it on here or stream it on YouTube. I'm not too sure. I haven't streamed on YouTube for a very long time. Doesn't really interest me that much anymore. I prefer Twitch. I'm one of them me that won't uh I won't watch anybody's uh any I won't watch anybody's gameplay of it until I've played it myself. I don't like I don't like games being spoiled for me really. And I want I wanna know what the storyline is. I wanna know what the deal I wanna wanna I wanna know what the deal is with Chris. Is he a villain in this new game or what? No, a lot of people are uh, a lot of people are switching over to to, to Twitch now because it's quite video game friendly. Um, so I don't trust Capcom no more. I'm really wondering. I'm really, really wondering what's happened to Chris though. Uh, whether he's a, a bad guy or. Yeah. Well, on PS5, it looks got it looks beautiful. The the graphics are unbelievable. Uh, you 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 come out of the jail cell and you go into this castle. Um, and you like you're walking around this castle and oh yeah, the graphics are gorgeous. Um, the castle kind of looks like the castle in Resident Evil Four. But you know. Yeah. Could be good. Get you <laughs> get used to the game and speed run it, show. <laughs> I've seen speedruns of uh, Resident Evil 7 before. Some people finish in the game in about 2 hours 30. Dude, every one of their grandmas is going to be speed running it. Speed running it. Kid you not. Yep. Yep. 
Day one. So you reckon from day one? They're gonna have to find out. They're gonna have to find out what's what in the game first before they speed run it. They're gonna have to go on a run where they're gonna, you know, like find out where everything, find out where everything is and stuff like that. And you know, yeah, because people want to grow and claim world record while they can. Yeah. You know, I find it hard to believe that people speed run this game. I just, I just couldn't imagine that. Couldn't imagine that because. You gotta level up, aren't you, and stuff like that before you take on anything. So speed running this game is just insane. That's just it really is. Okay, you know, to farm for souls, guys. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna go back to the um, the crypt. I'm thinking about it. But I'd rather the PC version, just don't think I can handle it. Just don't think it can handle it. Yeah. I see that Cactus still does a lot of uh, Dark, Souls, uh, Dark Souls content on Switch. He's, uh, he's constantly, um, he's constantly on Dark Souls 3, isn't he? And my god, his, uh, his build must be, must be really impressive now. On his character. Because he plays it so much. Yeah, that's all he plays. <laughs> yeah. Guy must be on New Game Plus 8 by now. <laughs> well, I've been playing this. I've been playing this every day. Uh, been playing it off camera. Uh, been playing it on on camera um you know just keep going and just keep i keep being addicted I'm, I'm like addicted to it i feel i feel like it's just uh, a goal to game really don't really want to play anything else um after the stream, spending it. <sighs> oh. Oh, you did a playlist last night? Uh, R5. I went off. I just felt really tired. Felt really tired and went for a lie down. Next thing I knew, it was R2 in the morning, so... Hopefully I don't, um, I don't get overcome by tiredness tonight. I'm only picking up 72 at a time, fuck's sake. It's just... It's not the, what I envisioned to farm for souls, but... I 
stunned him. Stunned him. Uh, 40 scores. No. Don't even know who we were playing last night. I know that Liverpool fell down to six. Chelsea and West Ham both won, so West Ham are now fourth and Chelsea are fifth. And <laughs> Liverpool are sixth. <laughs> Did you not die? Come on. Easy kills here, guys. One one shot kill, everyone. Now we've got to get a win against. Uh, we've got to get a win against Newcastle because if we don't beat Newcastle, then fuck it. It's all over. No, oh, I, I didn't really want that. Yeah, seeing that I can, uh, I can actually watch it now. I'll tell you what I am. <laughs> well, I can actually watch it now. Anyway, I've got like a full day to watch that. Ugh. 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 See, I'm yawning already. Fucking hell. It's just gone two o'clock, so. Let's bring them back. <laughs> no. I'll be back in it next year. For a while. I suppose. No. Oh. Up shit like that. Oh. Oh, Stunned him again. Yep. Showtime. Do you uh, do you know how you sell items in this game? Because I've still not found anybody, anyone that you, you can sell items to. And I'm wondering where the hell... You know. I'll play you a tune when you're in the party in a bit to hype up your spirits. As long as it's, ne as long as it's not, uh, you'll never walk alone. Hmm. Yeah, I, I don't know, show. Um... I'm wondering why you can't sell I you can't sell items off in this game. I don't know what all that's about. It's like it's, it's like it's not even possible. It's like you just don't get the option. Have I got enough now on the way back, or do I have to go? Uh, I never know. I 
<laughs> well, no, I don't. I'll find out later. Yeah, I'm not sure about this one. I know it's possible in other games with specific merchants. Yeah, but it seems in this one you can't even do, you can't even sell your um, sell your items on. It's kind of weird. God, that was a heavy impact. Get out of it. Uh, whoop! Bang. Just googled it. Go on. What do you do? Is he a guy? Is he someone? Oh, come on, 96. Fucking 96. Uh, after you ring the two bells, King Seeker Frampt will consume items for souls in the Firelink Shrine. Firelink Shrine? Well, this is the Firelink Shrine. Uh, whereabouts, whereabouts is he? Oh, hello. Why tell me that? Why, well, yes, of course. I'm still an able pyromancer. I shall locate him myself. I'm in your debt once again. Oh, look at all this. Uh, yeah, I, I mean, he must be. He must be. Uh, he must be round here somewhere then. I mean. That is it. It's noisy. It's, this is no laughing matter, I tell you. No. Damn. That stench. Yeah, yeah, I did you? Beginning to like it here. Oh, maybe it's time I do something about it. Yeah, random, yeah. But where the hell? You know, where the hell is he? She died as well inside there, and um, the fire went dead. The fire went dead. So. <laughs> Have a quick look around, see if I can find him. There's a lot of people like hanging around, hanging around here. There's this guy here. Oh, I'm sorry. Miracles, was it? Sometimes I lose. It's not this guy. Uh, yeah. No, it's not that guy. Wait, what the hell is this? I think I found him. Is it you who rang the bell of awakening? <laughs> hey, there we go, found him. Close friend of the great Lord Wind, chosen undead, who has rung the bell of awakening. I wish to elucidate your fate. Do you seek such enlightenment? Very well. Very well. <laughs> Chosen undead, your fate is to succeed the great Lord Wynn, so that you may link the fire, cast away the dark, and undo the curse of the undead. To this end, this guy. you must visit Anorlondo and acquire the Lord Vessel. Uh... I am pleased to see you well. Is it something urgent? E yeah, okay, feed item, feed. 
feed item? Oh, okay. Is that what you do? Do you feed? You feed it him? <laughs> Soul value 50. Okay. Oh, wow. So you just... He just tossed a... So just tossed a dagger into his mouth. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is funny. Get ready to get deafened, guys. <laughs> Gonna be shitting swords, right? I'm gonna keep that. I didn't even. Some of them I'm getting rid of. Butcher knife. Uh... Yeah, I've got I've got two other axes as well. I don't know. I'll get rid of that. Get rid of that one. Yeah, I noticed that. They're all 50, aren't they? All of them. Every single one. Oh, I've got more than one. Okay. Pyromancy Flames, a thousand. You have an item box in the bonfire too, you don't want to waste it, yeah. Yeah, I've got that. So many things I want to get rid of. I've been waiting for this guy. Yeah, definitely. I'm gonna be up I'm gonna be leveling up. Okay, right. Oh God. <laughs> um, you know I've got enough now. Farewell, children. Farewell. Yeah, yeah. That's what I was. That was that's what I'm building up to. Uh, a level up. I need a level. I need a level up now, and then. I'm gonna go into the place that nobody's seen yet. Um, not on my, not on my run anyway. Uh, I'm not, I'm not actually showing it, showing it on recordings yet. enough for a level up now. Oh. <laughs> Great. Could have given me a tight night chunk. Right. 
level up time. Two thousand eight hundred and eleven. I wonder if I can. Well, I don't want that. in arrows. Twenty-four thousand, just one. All right, guys. This is uh, this is the area that I opened up last night, and Jesus Christ, this is fucking solid. Sense, sense Fortress. I hate this area. Yes! Nice one. A parry kills it. I, I did get a kill last time on the parry. Great, I like that. I like that. True game, game progress. Yeah. actually recovered from that one. <laughs> it's this bit that I haven't got through yet. I just keep dying. I just, uh, I get so far and then I die. It's just like, uh. know this but upgrading your weapons is more helpful the more people realize yeah upgrading your weapons does so much and one of the best things you can focus on aside from leveling up currency yep yeah. Yeah, I usually I usually use magic, but 
Uh, I'll, I'll try my arrow. Try my arrows. Right, well, I'm gonna go again, guys, because this is a new area and I wanna show people this area, so. Oh, the bow's good if you get used to it. Yeah. Plus you can manually aim as well as lock on. Oh, you can actually manual aim on it. I didn't know you could do that. Come on. Looking for a stun lock button. Oh. Right. Come on. All career time style. Let's have a look at how do you work uh, how do you do it? Do you press square? Do you, you don't press square dark side? Uh what do you do here? Wait, okay. So basically it's right. Okay, I think uh, it's R1 to two hand and L1. Oh, L1 to fire. Ah, right, nice. I didn't even know you could do that. And then obviously you can change ammo. Yeah. Yeah, I didn't know you could actually, um, I didn't know you could actually do that. That's, that's cool, that's great, nice. So we can like, get rid of that snake then because he's a pain in the ass he's like he's always up here just in the way really basically and you can still lock on yeah oh I guess I'll have to be careful I didn't get him did I <laughs> he's looking at me, he's looking right at me now because I just hit him with uh, with an arrow. Thirteen damage. Uh Oh, can he get me with that? Oh no, he can't hit me. He's out of range. You're out of range. Did I miss? I've got a... I've got a crossbow as well. I have got a heavy crossbow. I've got a... I've got a few actually. Can you use... Can you do it with this? I take it you can't. I take it you can't do it with that. Uh, crossbow's kind of lame. <clears throat> can't manual lame. Mostly depends on lock on. Oh. Wait, what happened there? Is he dead? He's dead. I don't know how, but he's dead. Um, okay. Some people like the crossbow. Yeah, he actually died. I don't know how that, um, I don't know how that happened, but he died. He, um, it's like he committed suicide. Just didn't want to get hit by arrows anymore. Yep, he literally leapt off the edge. 
I got lucky there. Come on. No. No, no. Ugh. Got it. Come on. Yeah, he definitely, he definitely leapt off. Alright guys, so this is Sen's Fortress. This is a new area uh, that's not been recorded so far. Um, you got a lot of these uh, pendulums swinging around. They're a pain in the ass. I don't like this. Because of that, and I'm gonna get hit again. Ooh. There's a lot of ancient traps and stuff like that in this uh, section. Snake just got smashed by the boulder. Oh, as if he's coming up. No. Like, oh, I wanted him to stay put. Bad timing, bad timing, I'm dead. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. See, this is what I mean. This whole, that whole section is just, I didn't want that guy to come up because I knew that I'd struggle against him, so. Cast it to the demon pit, yeah. Right, uh, I'm gonna end it, guys. Um, Showtime. And uh, Spendini, thanks for stopping by, guys. Appreciate it. Um, so that's part 14 of this whole, uh, this whole like first ever playthrough of this game, guys. And um, yeah, exactly, yeah. Um, it's quite possible that the next part might be a recording because obviously I've got to try and get through this section now. Um, but once I'm through it, God, it's going to be great. It's going to be great once I get through that section because it's just killing me off. Um, we've done a lot of things, guys. We've upgraded the great axe. We've got, we've got uh, a new, we've got like new stuff on there. We've got like black on now. This is mainly poison resist, poison resist stuff. Um, and we bought, we've like upgraded another loads of other stuff as well. Found out the place where you sell items. Looks like a giant worm coming out. This like a giant worm end guy. I don't know weird um but yeah guys that's pretty much it uh for now all right thanks all for joining by appreciate it i'm the dark side gamer peace out everyone take care